Hey guys, it's way back with another review today, and I have one of the new LEGO Marvel Spider-Man sets. It's the Miles Morales mech armor, and I'm actually very excited for this one because I know they announced it last year. Um, and there were some leaked photos, and I was actually very excited. Not so much for the mech. The mech is whatever. I'm just more excited about the actual minifigure itself. Um, definitely, it's one of the minifigures I've definitely wanted for since they announced it. Um, it's 125 pieces, set number 76171, um, age 7 and up. Uh, definitely excited for it. Awesome, awesome set. Um, give me a look on the box. So, uh, yeah, enough talk, and yeah, let's definitely get it. <laughs> Alright guys, and I am back. Okay, so, like I said, I wasn't really in it for the mech, and I'm glad I wasn't really going in, and my, uh, not quite sure how to say it, my expectations for the actual mech weren't that much, um, I was actually kind of like happy for this printed piece right here, because there was no stickers in the set at all, so that's a plus, um, not that many, uh, extra pieces, glad about that. Um, one thing I do have to say is very, very skinny, very lanky, um, compared to, like, uh, the Captain America one, or the Thor one, or the Spider-Man one, or the Iron Man one, or even the Thanos. Um, I don't know, like, I feel like they kinda, oh, I feel like they kinda, uh, went down as far as piece count, as far as, like, um, adding to the mech itself. Like, I know it's supposed to be small skinny and agile um obviously because it's just a spider-man mech so it's supposed to be it's not supposed to be that very bulky but i would like to have a little bit of more mass to it um just to give it a little bit more of intimidation because i i feel like if anyone popped up in this mech and you pop up in a thor one i feel like the thor one would be more menacing than a, a, the spider-man one um again i am just this that's just my opinion i like how the build is um i like the colors that they use especially like the clear um electric blue that they used for the actual webbing here and then on the legs right there and then on the back too especially with the uh, web handcuffs right here attachment which i'm glad they actually came with that because i know for the spider-man mag they didn't um and here and then you also got the big blast of uh web coming out of his hands um very posable i got it in a pose right now that way it doesn't fall um I think the only thing that kind of more excites me is the actual minifigure. I think that excites more people, the minifigure, than the actual mech. But the mech is a pretty cool addition. Um, here's Miles Morales. Um, I love how they kind of kept the design from Into the Spider-Verse, which I'm kind of actually glad. So you got the design on the decal on the back. And you also have the decal on the front. And then this actually does come off. And doesn't have a two-sided face and like almost like every other spider-man they don't have a double-sided face and then you got like the little i guess sting that he does or that could be him shooting web not quite sure um let you decide that to be honest um i like the uh, printing that they actually did on the legs um it's not much but it's just to indicate that he actually uh is wearing shoes it actually gives a little bit more detail than um just leaving the decal in the chest in the back just it being that um obviously you couldn't do much detailing as far as the arms um because obviously he's wearing a hoodie so there really isn't much detail you can add unless it's an actual spider-man minifigure um but like overall set including the minifigure oops um i had to give it a eight and a half out of ten um instructions weren't that hard to follow pretty easy um just like any other mech um only reason i'm getting it an eight and a half is because as far as how the build of the mech is i feel like they could have definitely added more mass to it and give it a little bit more intimidation especially um since it's a spider-man one um but i mean any like to be honest anyone can add to it anyone can just add pieces to it at your uh once you buy it from your edition of your uh, lego collection you can just add to it um that's just me though um i like the set completely definitely excited for the actual minifigure that is definitely one of the pluses of, of this set um like i said no stickers pretty easy to follow through instructions uh pretty easy build and excellent minifigure so definitely my opinion eight and a half out of ten i would give it a nine for the minifigure um but yeah um like i said um 
great set overall so definitely like comment and subscribe join the family um definitely more content coming your way especially more reviews and mocks coming so definitely join to stay tuned for that so i guess i will see y'all in the next video